Hey, what's up everyone? I'm Caitlin from Corlex and I'm going to show you what's in my closet. My style is a mix of vintage fashion and gothic fashion. Definitely some glamorous items in there. I love to be as glamorous as possible, especially when I'm shooting music videos or performing. And so I just decided to show you guys a little bit of my wardrobe and how I put things together. And here's the first item. Um, this I love. It is a vintage feather boa. And when I say vintage, I really mean vintage. Not from the 90s, not even from the 80s. We're talking tassels, fabulousness from the 60s. And I have a lot of these really special, super vintage items that were gifted to me from Brandon's grandmother. And she was actually a singer in way back in the day. And she also gave me this incredible hand beaded feather vintage gown. And I would just love to try this on for you guys so you can really see how beautiful it is. absolutely such a stunning piece and I normally would pair a vintage dress with something like a little gothic to sort of make it more my style but this is just so amazing it really just doesn't need anything and I would accessorize this with just like a simple kitten heel these are my vintage Versace's and again, I am just all about beautiful, old, timeless pieces. And actually, I would pair this with these beautiful sheer gloves to just complete the look. is just to take dresses that aren't necessarily gothic and accessorize them in a way where like it's fitting my style more. So this is just like a beautiful dress I got in LA a couple years ago. I don't even know the designer, um, Jay Godfrey. Um, I got it at Intermix. If anyone knows that store, it's like an amazing store. So. This is just like a good example of, you know, you can really do anything with any type of dress and make it a little more spooky if you just know how to accessorize. And then I would definitely probably just add, you know, a nice cute little waist center. And I would match it with this old lip service jacket I've had. I've had this jacket forever, for like seriously 10 years. And um, yeah, maybe I pair it with like a cute little witchy spiky boot. I actually customize these myself. I just Love to add spikes to things. And there we go. I think this is like very modern. I think like green earth tones with black is gorgeous. This is another dress I wanted to talk about. Um, this is also extremely old. I think it's actually from the 50s. It's all hand embroidered um, from an Italian designer, but it just, it's like really special. I wore it in the music video for To Off Everything. You guys can check that out, that scene. Um, but I paired it with 
a nice chunky, super spiky goth collar because I thought the contrast of those two things were just like so cool and yeah, it was definitely gorgeous. Maybe I'll try it on with some boots. like anyone else even if you buy stuff from you know Killstar or whatever like that's fine but just mix it with original pieces another look I want to talk about is sheer I'm a huge fan of sheer and um, this is just this is um you know golf shop golf shop dress but you can really turn something like this into the ultimate glamour look if you just accessorize. Now one thing I love to accessorize with is obviously leather and spikes and all of that. Um, definitely always a great idea to have a nice little corset cincher hanging around. They always come handy. You could throw this on literally any anything. So I'm not even gonna do it all the way right now because that would take a little bit too long. But I love this uh, lace cincher it's from Corset Story. And this by itself is cute, but I want to like go even more fabulous and I want to add in some tool. <laughs> I'm sure you guys have seen me in photos with tons of fabric and I just, I love, 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 love to add tool to any look. And I just think it makes it all the more fabulous. And really, with tool, you can just tuck it in anywhere. And voila, oh, you literally have a ball gown, something so glam in seconds. You could tuck it in through a waist cincher, really anything and you could just keep adding layers so you obviously have even more tool and I think adding it to the hips especially is just like so so stunning and there you go and then of course I would absolutely finish the look with my favorite, absolute favorite choker. I'll put the link in the description for the artist that makes these. And honestly, I think what would make this look, I would pair it with a cute white booty because I just think it would make the whole outfit pop even more. And it's just like a little piece of unexpected 
you know, fashion. dress and I just attached some spikes but this is fun I have a mirror this way so <laughs> you can see everything this is fun this is a little more like you know moody but maybe to make it yeah, I have this sweet little um, necklace that my my grandma actually gave to me. Really cute. And just a little touch of class to it. Well, that's it from me, and I hope you guys enjoyed this. I have so many more clothes that I could show you, so if you did enjoy this, let me know, and uh, yeah, maybe we'll try some more stuff together, and I'll let you into my whole closet.